mission is to provide sports training and competition opportunities for individuals with intellectual disabilities throughout the state of Oklahoma um, that are eight years of age or older. And we have some individuals in their upper 70s and even into their 80s that still participate in Special Olympics Oklahoma. We're the 23rd largest program for the numbers of athletes that we serve throughout the country. So we have over 11,600 athletes that participate in the program. And our summer games, which is just one event out of more than 140 that take place throughout the calendar, throughout the year, throughout the state, summer games have over 5,017 athletes registered. Yeah, big. We've got a wonderful medical community and healthy athletes is a big part of our program that we offer throughout the state and throughout the year. So wonderful opportunities and what a great medical community that we have in Oklahoma from dentistry to optometrists to just a variety of specialists that have a love for serving individuals with special needs and so we can be a resource and help point people out to those professionals as well. There's a lot of ways to help out. First of all, go to our website. It's a very easy address, so you don't even have to write it down. You'll memorize it. SOOK.org. www.sook.org. Go to our website. There's all kinds of opportunities to volunteer, but also to give. You know, the last two and a half years has been tough in Oklahoma uh, economically for a lot of us, and obviously in the charitable realm, that's, that's certainly the case. Uh, but it's amazing the strength of our board of directors. They ensure that whatever it takes to offer our programs, no matter where we are from a financial standpoint, we're going to offer this program. And it's great. It's proven that there's a great need there. So, but we need people to help. If people want to support our cause, go to the website, contact us directly, send a check to our organization, whatever's easiest for the individual donor but also get on there and volunteer. See all the different opportunities. You can come out for just a half a day. You can come out for a morning. You can give up a full day. We've seen as more people get involved initially and they have the opportunity to communicate directly with uh, individuals with intellectual disabilities, the desire for them to get more involved and more engaged continues to grow. And, and we're a volunteer-driven grassroots-level organization, so we have 12 staff people and we have over 11,000 Oklahomans that volunteer, serving over 11,600 athletes. So it is not staff driven. We are totally dependent upon volunteers. And as our program continues to grow, the need for volunteers continues to grow. So if anybody is interested in volunteering, please visit our website, figure out a way to get involved. We'd love to have you and there's plenty of room for everybody.